Hello once again everyone, Original Blood Ace here, and we have an interesting story to talk about today. Which is... A guy gets stabbed with a Master Sword, as you can see. A replica <laughs> of a Master Sword from The Legend of Zelda. So this story happened in Texas. We got two guys, uh, and then a girl involved in this story guy and a girlfriend live in the house they have an argument the girlfriend for some weird unknown fucking reason calls her estranged ex-husband who shows up at their house she lets him in and he gets into the house and he comes after the boyfriend I suppose uh, so the guy goes to his room, grabs his Master Sword replica, which this was, it's not like plastic, it's metal, uh, but points it at the door. He says in the video he can hear the guy coming towards him. The guy runs around the corner, comes into the house, or into his room, runs right at him, and runs right into the fucking Master Sword, right into the tip of it, and he gets stabbed. Now the guy manages to get himself, or, you know, get the guy out of his house and lock the door. Now, here's where the story kind of gets, and it shouldn't really be funny, but it is, it's just so ridiculous. But the guy manages to not only get back in, he breaks down the front door, but he also picks up a flower pot and breaks it over the guy's head, the boyfriend who had the master sword. And he got a, a cut on his forehead and he had to go get it stitched up and everything. The guy, all, the, somehow the husband also got stabbed in the leg at some point. But this just sounds so fucking funny. Guy gets stabbed by master sword, dropping a, pl a pot on someone's head. Were you expecting rubies to come out? A fairy, maybe? Too bad he didn't have a fairy in a bottle to revive him. <laughs> People have been making so many jokes about, like, oh, it's just Link slaying Ganon, nothing new here. Uh, or, too bad he didn't have the shield to go with the sword, he could have protected himself from getting hit in the head with a pot. It's just, <laughs> it's so fucking funny. But it really shouldn't be. I mean, it's it's sad, and people are going to blame... Uh, some The media is going to somehow blame, oh, video games lead to violence, blah, blah, blah. If he didn't have a Master Sword, the guy wouldn't have got stabbed. Yeah, then the guy would have just gotten beat up in his house. <laughs> anyway, that's really all I wanted to say. The one guy, he's going to be fine. Uh, with a cut on his head, he'll be fine in no time at all. The other guy was in, what was it, critical condition or whatever, but I mean, when you run into a sword multiple times, you gotta wonder, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> anyway, uh, it's a short video I wanted to talk about. It just sounds too funny to be true, but it is. There's a video if you go to the IGN website and read about it, uh, and then go to that, or click to Houston website. There's a video, uh, it was on the news apparently, they were interviewing the guy. So if you want to go watch it, you can go do that. Uh, yeah, I'm Original Bloody. Stay tuned, more videos coming soon. <laughs> a Master Sword. What's next? I'm the cult of personality. The cult of personality. The cult of personality.